few days ago, I read eh, that Hadi Awang says openly that the concept of DNAA tak wujud dalam Islam. Of course, coming from a lebay uh, yang who uh, who is a hypocrite through and through, uh, trying to redefine Islam uh, bagi dia dia berhak untuk buat whatever fatwa and to tailor Islam to how he likes it. Now he says DNAA tak termasuk dalam hukum Islam. There's no such thing in Islam as DNAA. Now firstly, this lebay tuala ni, I don't even know which school he went to. Does he even understand what DNAA means? Uh, this is one question lah. Tapi katakan dia percaya DNAA, discharge not amounting to acquittal and everything. Uh, you want to take it from this guy ke? Yang who him he himself, uh, yang kata rasuah tak termasuk dalam takrifan hudud. Rasuah tu is suka sama suka. Yang memberi itu pun dengan rela, yang menerima pun dengan rela. Jadi kita tinggal pada kerajaan untuk menentukan hukuman yang sepatutnya. So Zahid punya kes bukan rasuah ke? Rasuah kan? Jadi kalau rasuah, kalau betul dia bersalah pun, is suka sama suka lah kan? Jadi based on what hadis says, kita tinggalkan pada kerajaan, kerajaan uruskan. Itu untuk undang-undang kerajaan, tak termasuk dalam hukum budut. So what is hadis talking now? Tak wujud ke apakah? Why is he commenting even about it? Whatever kerajaan, you kata kerajaan akan handle. So kerajaan handle, kerajaan charge ke, kerajaan acquit ke, kerajaan grant discharge not amounting to acquittal ke. Be consistent lah. Ha? Tapi of course, orang yang hipokrit, ha? bersifat-sifat, berciri-cirikan munafik, they go back against their own words. They say, they, they talk with a fork tongue. Ha? Kiri cakap lain, kanan cakap lain. So dia kata itu semua itu terpulang pada undang-undang kerajaan. He says that maknanya hudud ni hudud ni hukum Islam. Ha, jadi what he saying is that tak termasuk hukum Islam lah. Itu tinggal pada kerajaan tu decide. Maknanya Allah tak prescribe. So I'm using again his perverse logic. Okay. Now musim sekarang ni whenever all these uh, dissenters and these hypocrites they start making their own rules and their own set of logic. I'm going to use their set of logic uh, just like I did for Syed Sadiq. I will do this also for Hadi Awang. Okay, so dia kata tak termasuk hukum hudud. Hudud tu hukum Islam. Jadi maknanya macam Islam got no answer for for rasuah. So that is left to the government to deal with it. So now the government deals with it. So masuk pula sekarang cerita, oh dalam Islam tak ada undang-undang DNAA. I thought who Islam punya hukum tak ada mention, tak ada apa ni doesn't don't even deal, deal with uh, rasuah. Rasuah tak termasuk dalam hukum hudud according to Hadi who has tailor made Islam uh, based on apa dia kata. Dia decide, dia tailor made Islam tu. Uh, so sekarang ni yang dia tailor made tu pun boleh tukar balik pula. Different narrative. Uh, this is what happens when you're a pathological liar lying through your teeth. You can't even remember your own lies. You forget what you concoct and what you bullshit. And then lepas tu, after that, you start making statement to contradict your own self. So therefore, there are people-people like me who will expose you bare naked to show how ugly you are on the outside and the inside. Enough said.